What's up guys, it's Fred here. It's uh, gonna be a nice little switch up from Doozy being the ones that makes these videos, but today I'm gonna show you how you're gonna install Ronin Wallet onto your computer so that you can easily get paid out by our us managers and we could easily send you SLP safely and efficiently. So the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna go on Google and you have to be on Google Chrome too and what you're gonna click is Google Extensions. And now usually the first thing that's going to come up is this Chrome Web Store and that's what you're going to click on. And in the top left here, we're going to click search the store and we're going to search up is Ronin Wallet. And what that's going to do is it's going to bring up this Ronin Wallet and we're going to click on it and add to Chrome. You're going to click add extension and just wait for it to install onto your computer. And so what we're going to do is we're going to just click on this uh, puzzle piece icon here on the top right and we're going to click this pin button so th what that does is now we could easily access it from clicking a bunch of random buttons to get this page as soon as you click Ronin wallet what you're going to do is you're going to get this screen and the first thing you should do is press get started it's going to redirect you to this page and obviously you're watching this video because you haven't set one up before so what we're going to click on is I'm new let's get set up so f first thing you're going to get is you're going to get this create a wallet page and the first step in creating a wallet is creating a password. Create your password and uh, you're going to have to confirm your password, put the same thing as in you've done this multiple times probably. And so what we're going to do is we're going to go to the next step and create wallet. Okay. And then so the next part of the phase of creating the wallet is the seed phrase. Now disclaimer it is really important that you remember your seed phrase you should probably take a picture write it down do both but make sure you know exactly what your seed phrase is the importance of the seed phrase is that if you ever forget your password it's not as simple as just cr clicking forgot your password and it sends you an email it's, it's not like that what it's first going to ask you is your seed phrase and that's what you're going to need to either log in or to change your password and so what you're going to do is you're going to click on reveal seed phrase. Obviously it's blacked out for you guys so you guys don't see what my seed phrase is. But what you're going to do is you're going to take a picture just like I am right now. Take the picture and make sure that you have it written down or somewhere safe. The next part is you're going to confirm seed phrase. Click on that. And then the next step is confirming your seed phrase. So you're going to get four empty boxes with a number on top of it and then you're going to write down the word that is associated to that number. So I'm writing it down right now. So the numbers I got is number one, number four, number eight, and number 10. And then so once that's done, you're going to put that all in, click continue. And then the next thing that should happen is that it's that you get the screen called your wallet has been created and from there on you should be good to go so if you go back on to the Ronin wallet extension click on that the page you get is gonna be completely different than what you first got so now you're gonna see this entire screen it's gonna show you what's filled up in your account like what portfolios you have and what kind of axes you have as well now, this is also another important part. When managers ask you what your Ronin wallet is, you're going to click this two square button called copy address. You're going to click on it and then you're going to paste it to your manager. So once you click on it and you copied it and you sent it to your manager, the first part should be starting off with Ronin semicolon and a bunch of numbers and letters combined together. And that's what you're going to send to your manager so that they can send you SLP when your payout, payout date has come. So some other functions that it has is that you could send other currencies to other people. You could either send ETH, you could sell AXS, or you could also send SLP and those other, other parts of it. But the most important part is that you're probably just copying the address sending the ronin address to your manager so that they could pay you out thanks for watching guys and i hope you guys get your next payout peace